uh, we start with Anas Arimeya Anasis Modus Operandi in his latest documentary that has been questioned by MP Fasin Central Kennedy Japan, who is threatening to expose what he describes as some ill deeds of the investigative journalist. Take a listen. That man, the pictures from UK and Dubai. Me, I'm challenging him. Let me see it, man. We challenge him, mass. We cannot allow this rot to go on in this country. Hell no, it's not going to happen. A mass can say a mass. A human, a dog can see a wussy, see a wussy thing. Now, coffee tea should go and check. Why else are coffee teas? We are being demonstrations. He uses a police officer called Gilbert Aga. Now, I go after IGP. Why is it that a mass? Who is he? That constant 24-7 that they are basically the a police officer open. I will strip him naked for Ghanaians to see who announces. And when we finish today, I'll bring you more evidence and pictures. Maybe just show me TV station so that Kwaku Bako ne nika so mko siwa omu siwa. Meanwhile, the ace journalist says this will not deter him and his team from airing the documentary. Do you think Anas has the right to do what he did? Is it allowed? Say who could show? They have to stop him. Somebody should take him to court right now to stop him from what he's doing. <laughs> It's a pure black man to enrich himself. So let's do a boy on today. Come on, Joey. I like you. You're not going to be here. You're going to be here. Okay, so what you just watched is a promo to counter what uh, Kennedy Japan has been saying um, since uh, this news came out. But uh, so the question is, and the promo is actually asking you to decide. So where do you stand to air or not to air? Just as the saying goes, any idiot can go to court. It also means that anybody at all can make allegations. But what makes this different is that you make the allegations, then you provide hardcore evidences. That is what makes Anas different. How are you supposed to verify that this picture has come from Kennedy Japan or not? So you need to go beyond that. If you can also put it together, organize a cinema, I mean, you may also find sponsors somewhere people also go and watch. So you can have Anas having a counter and so on and so forth. So he is he's a noise maker. He's always a noise maker. And he'll continue to make noise. But the, for, the fortunate thing is that his noise doesn't get anywhere. If he cannot pay his workers as journalists to, live, uh, to have a good living, people are paying Anas to have a good living. If he claims he has sold uh, 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 pure water, he has driven, uh, what do you call it, taxi in the US, he has sold PK to have become rich today. He can't tell me that nobody, no genuine Ghanaian who is a journalist is doing the work of Anas cannot become rich. So if he cannot pay his journalists very well and believe that he cannot become rich through dubious means, then I'm telling him that Anas is doing a genuine job and he's paid well. I think if you have integrity, you shouldn't be afraid of what Anas is doing or what he's bringing out there. And what he's saying about he going to expose him and he frauding people and all that. Okay, you had all this information, so why now? He's making a thing look like he's so tense. Like, so I don't really agree with him that he's blackmailing people. Because if he was blackmailing people, he wouldn't have bring it out. The fact that he has, um, he has expensive mansions and all that, that doesn't mean he blackmails. Um, Anas has his philosophy, which is name, shame and jail. So if he provides evidence and all that, so if you are making such claims, you should also come up with hardcore evidence, uh, maybe a footage of him blackmailing someone. All right, very interesting comments from the streets of Accra. A lot of the comments are also on Facebook. Let's check them out. As Rafiq uh, says, why is Ken, uh, Kenneji Pon, Ken Pon so self-centered? So why has he never come out to talk plenty like this on any of the Anas documentaries? Is it because he is featured in this particular one? Every road must be exposed, no matter what. Kobe Billy says, I don't get why some Ghanaians are drawing their own country back in Egypt. Japan is not a person to be taking as a role model. You see the GFA president, 
And uh, do you think corruption can be eradicated from this country if we have leaders like this working against progress? I don't go, says, I stand 101% with the Nance. The rot in Ghana football is too much. Imagine coefficient in football. It's a shame. And Scholar Rao says, to air it, of course, Canadian Japan is jealous because Christine Yantechi is his best friend. Inspector Anas must expose him as well as as well because his wealth is not genuine. By Jeremiah says, be aired that it is even still far. <laughs> I can't wait to watch the video. Those against it can go and burn the sea. And Boris say Kamal Dean says the video should be aired. The wild allegations of Kennedy will cause Anas to back down his quest to show the video. And Al Hassan Abdul Fatal says this man must be very careful. Is it why Anas Anas reveals the secrets of this men in this country or what? Okay. And uh, those are very interesting comments on Facebook. So, I she or, but, well, well, that person is claiming to be the real Anna. Okay, so mm. <laughs> for, you, for, out for you know, I, I, um, Aisha could be the real Anna. You know, you never know. <laughs> Let's check right. out the Twitter trends. So, on uh, Twitter trends, we have the I am an ass uh, hashtag uh, going trending. Uh, I hate corruption. And he puts this picture there. Okay. All right, so we have uh, Michael OTAJ to saying, uh, like the Jabari <laughs> warrior, Anas is defending the truth, hey. standing, uh, the st defending the faith, standing up for the rest. I am Anas. So, <laughs> <laughs> okay, OTAJ says he's Anas. Uh, and it, it's, it's trending, I am Anas. It's trending. Oh, so they say the angels are behind us. <laughs> <laughs> Nemo Kaffee and I and I and <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that's, that's how we end the interactive segment. My name is Aisha Prime. Have a great one.